But me and this guy are respectful. Now, justice. There was this king. All right, bro. There was this king, right? He made a law. He said anybody steals, their eyes must be plucked out. So one day, his son was captured for stealing. And he was taken to the dungeon, and they were about to take his eyes out. But because he was the king, he went down. He said, that's my son. Don't take his eyes out. Take my eyes out. Yeah, yeah. God, because he's the ultimate authority, can say, I'm going to die for you. So on that cross, Jesus took your hit, took your punishment for you, bro. And for me, that's what it means there. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son, that whoever believes in him shall not perish but have everlasting life. He took your hit for you, bro. So if you die tonight, where are you going to be? Take the punishment from me now, okay? That's why I can go to hellfire, right? Because he takes punish, okay? So I don't need to believe as Jesus Christ God. Listen. Because he sacrificed for himself. Listen, you're making a good point. But if your kidneys pack in, what would happen if your kidneys pack in? You, your kidneys. If your heart packed in, what would happen if your heart packed in? You're dead, aren't you? Yeah? But what if someone donated their heart to you? Would you take it? You wouldn't take it. So what would happen to you? No, your heart packs in. Someone offers their heart to you. That will help you. And you don't take the heart, what would happen to you? Right. God has given you salvation. Wait a minute, let me finish. He's giving you salvation, bro. You have to have faith in Jesus, believe in Jesus. If you believe in Jesus, you're saved. You reject him, just like you reject a heart. Kapoor. Now Jesus talked more about hell than he did about heaven, believe it or not. That's faith. He died for something he must do. He died for something he didn't do. What? No, because... Because, bro, I'll tell you a story. Can I punish this man for this sin? No, he didn't do that. So Jesus Christ punished for everyone sins. Let, let me let me explain. Yes. Why? Is that? I go with that like That's this. Not if you want to kill my friend, huh? if you want to kill my brother, I will catch you, and that you can kill me in, instead. Because yes, it's okay. out, of, out of love. Out it's out of love. love. It's out of love that God came down and died yeah. for you, bro. He come to save you, man. Come to save you. That's not fair for Jesus. Yeah, but, but wait a minute. In God heaven, in heaven, he decided God. to come for you, lovingly decided. He knew your name, and he lovingly decided to come down for you, bro. So he willingly came down. He willingly went to the cross. He willingly died on the cross. He willingly took that hit for everybody here. He willingly took that hit. Shake my hand, bro, just a minute. Just shake your hand. He's a Muslim, we're a Christian, we're respectful, and we're having a respectful dialogue. Give him a, give him a clap for his, his respect, yeah? Keep going, yeah? No, because, no, because you're, you're a credit to Manchester, bro, the way you're conducting yourself. So keep going. Okay. I didn't understand that Jesus is a man as a holy guy. I can thank you. Well, let, let me, let, let, now, as I'm talking to you, please don't take this the wrong way. I'm going to have to talk about Islamic theology and Christian theology. Okay. In Islamic theology, there's the idea that God is one. No, right? Split the word up, lad. Satan, God. God bless split you. Split the word up. Satan, God. That's what you worship. All right. Satan, God. All right. It's not like it's being an intellectual. That's like All, right. All right, mate. It's not, it's, it's, All right. it's not a Jeremy Carl show, bro. It's not a Jeremy Carl show. Have a nice day. I'll buy you a coffee in a bit, mate. I'll buy you a nice coffee. All right, God bless you, bro. Have a nice day, bro. Have a nice day. Okay. Have a nice day. Have a nice day, bro. Have a nice day. God bless you. Have a day. You, you're too smart, mate. Mate, you're too smart for me. Mate, you're well, well too smart for me. I can't cope with your smartness. Mate, I can't cope with your smartness. You're too smart for me, mate, I tell you. Too smart. You're too smart. And don't be swearing like a gangster rapper. Okay, bro. Don't be swearing like a gangster rapper. We're not in New York, bro. Come on, bro.
All right, have a nice day. Someone buy me coffee. Anyone got some money? Get me coffee, yeah? I believe the Father of God, as the Holy Spirit of God, yeah. as the Son of God, and these three is the one. Yeah. Okay. Let me show you. The Bible says you uh, study to prove yourself. Three are one. You need to study. The Holy Spirit is You need okay. to study. Right. I'm not one, one times one times one. What's that? Yeah? Are you sure? Yes. What's one times one times one, anybody? Three. What is, what is it? One. One times one times one is not three. It's one. You got three and one. One times one times one is one. That's three and one. So we've just done a little bit of mathematics. Three and one. Okay? What? Jesus is not the Father. No, no, listen, he listen. Never, he no, he said we he's been sent. Listen. And we have all the Spirit. Listen. This, this, this is God. Listen. If you, if you, if I make this, what do you call me? Baptize in the name of Jesus, right? Yes. Baptize in the name of Jesus. Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Three names you told, not one name. Uh, let me explain that. At the end of Matthew 27, it says, Go in the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. Notice this. It doesn't say, In the name of the Father, in the name of the Son, in the name of the Holy Spirit. It says this. Listen. It says, In the name of the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. For a, a Jew to hear that, they would think that was blasphemy because there's only one name, and the name is Yahweh. There's only one God. Listen, listen. And for the Jewish person, there's only one name, and that is Yahweh. So when Jesus says, go in the name of the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, they are sharing the same name, the name of God. Sharing the same name of God, bro. What do you think, bro? Nice to meet you. Nice to see you, to see you nice. All right. Okay. Come on, bro, we go. Why, why are you all listening to this guy? Why are you thinking for yourself? We are men. We are men. Listen to some guy. Listen to some guy. Well, at least we're having a dialogue. We're having a dialogue. Listen. What's up? What's up? What's up? Just chill out, chill out. Right, what, what's in Exodus 20? Tell us. What, what, tell us, what's your agenda? What's your agenda? If you'd open the Bible up to the passage that I'm asking for, it could read it to you all. It tells you how to beat your slave. Okay, let me ask you something. Let me ask you something. Let me ask you something. Do you know Hebrew? Do you know Hebrew? Okay, so don't be making claims like that till you know Hebrew, bro. Okay, take Okay, okay. I'm just have a just have a chill pill. I'm a chill pill. I'm a chill pill. Just chill. Just take a chill. Take a chill. You just stand there a minute. What's your name? I'm not, I'm not gonna have a dialogue with you unless you stop the passive aggressiveness, mate. No, no, you're passive aggressive. No, no, me and this Muslim, me and this Muslim, we had a nice conversation. You were passive aggressive. You've got an agenda. Right? No, no, no. Anybody else want to come in here and have a dialogue? If not, we're going to close, right? No, no, we're going to close. We're going to close.